Welcome back to the struggle that is Nobukatsu. Um, yeah, so I spent a few minutes looking at this, trying to figure out what I'm going to do to survive. <laughs> Just going to come down to the Tokugawa, bailing us out, I think. Okay, so before I get started, let me say we have the Mazayuki playthrough going on the channel. I'm going to have some battles getting uploaded. Um, I might do a short video covering the uh, this DLC scenario. Maybe like 10 minutes, not very long, but just giving my thoughts on it. Uh, basically the fact that it's more of an add-on to DLC. I should probably shouldn't call it DLC at this point. I feel like that's doing it at this service, but either way... We've got some more stuff coming up on the channel, so make sure you sub to the channel if you haven't already. And, uh, you know, hit the like button, all that stuff. This is tough. I mean, we're, we're barely coasting right now. Barely scraping by, but we are scraping by. Oh, battle. Here we go. Plus one valor. The courageous is the perfect name to exemplify the glorious deeds of my lord, Nobukatsu Oda. Yeah. We have a real... The emperor has no clothes situation going on in Owari right now because... If you guys didn't see the cutscene... Nobukatsu starts just cutting down retainers that disagree with him about him being the legitimate heir. Which he is the legitimate heir, don't get me wrong. But, you know, Katsue was a fierce supporter of the Oda, and even Katsue passed over Nobukatsu. You know, he was like, Nobukatsu, no, that guy's, that guy's trash. We're going to give it to the grandson. Um, so, he is the legit heir, but... Was he the best choice? I don't think so. Okay, so let me see. I know we can call him the Tokugawa. Problem is Hideyoshi himself is heading over here. Is he heading this way? Oh no, okay, he's dealing with that guy. Also, I think this guy died. I think I lost the uh, the lore to this castle. I must have lost it on Saturday's live stream. Don't know how. Well, I mean, I know how. It must have been battle. I do re kind of remember somebody dying. It must have been him, so... Stupid thing is I can't fill in the position until this guy's done attacking. Which... Okay, first things first, we're going to get Nobukatsu back to base. I mean, there, there's really nothing else I can do. I don't really think I can help here. I can't do anything about it. Like I said, we have to get ready for Hideyoshi. Oh, what the hell? Hideyoshi with the switch up. Okay. His AI's got a brain. It's not good. Okay. Tokugawa. One unit. That's trash. What about here? Five units. Okay. How many people do... Oh, only two days. Okay, let's wait two days. Let's wait two days and see if... Uh, Am I going to survive? I don't know if I'm going to make it, though. Alright. We just... I don't know if I'm going to make it here. Shit, I forgot to pull my chat up. 
Bum, bum, bum. Okay. Yeah, so, okay. Desperate defense. How many days do I have to wait? Three days? Two days. Okay. Now let's ask for reinforcements. Three units, 6,400. One unit. I don't know why it's only one unit there, but... Is the help going to make it in time? These two guys are at least. Okay. I don't think it matters. I think I'm going to lose the spot. You know, the goal of today was to uh, win a battle and f get a truce with the Hashiba. I really feel like I need a breather. I know Hideyoshi doesn't need a breather, but I need a breather. But I feel like if it's on their terms, they're going to demand that I sever my alliance with the Tokugawa. And that would be game over anyway. Oh, you're just going to have to get in there, man. We're going we're gonna to lose the spot. Where are the Tokugawa reinforcements? Not even close. Shit. I hate that you guys do this to me. Alright. Hideyoshi's on the way. Let's just see how bad this looks right now. Let's just see. Oh, man, we are done for. <laughs> what I can do is sacrifice my units. Oh, my God. I can sacrifice my units to the Tokugawa and then fight with the Tokugawa forces when they get here. Maybe that'll be enough. I doubt it, though. Okay, so I'm going to have him wait there. This guy's stats are horrendous, if I remember correctly. <clears throat> Wouldn't it be great to kill Hideyoshi? That'd be awesome. Those are back-to-back -back tribe units up there. That guy's 28. There's, uh, what's his name? What is his name? Shigehide. It's only got 600 soldiers. I really wish I could win. If I had the soldiers right now to win a battle. Yeah, this guy's just getting destroyed. I don't think he can take another hit. Like I said, unfortunately, this guy... The lord of this castle died. I don't think the Tokugawa reinforcements are going to make it. Tokuhime is ready to go. Like I said, I can try for a truce, but if I try for a truce... Because I'm going to lose the castle, I'm pretty sure he's going to demand that we sever our alliance with Ieyasu. That's game over. That's pretty much death. Anyway. Shit. I'm just going to give him the castle. I can't. I can't hold it. I think I'm just, uh... I'm being pretty stubborn at this point. We should just give him the castle. He's blockading for some reason. I don't know why he's blockading.
Okay, Nagashima's down. If we lose the battle, nothing really, but I just really needed to, uh... Oh, well, that's pathetic. 700 soldiers. I like having Nagashima holding it, because it's kind of a bulwark against everything else. So then they can only come in through Kyushu or Nagashima. Now they're pushing us back, so now they'll be able to hit from two angles. So if they consistently start invading me here, now I'm going to lose these counties consistently. Okay. So this is just going to come down to one big battle. Fifty. What about the Chosokabe? Chosokabe are kind of recuperating. They're kind of recuperating because they lost this castle. They had they had to fight a two front war against the Shimazu. The Shimazu went across this way, and the Toyotomi went across this way. So, this is probably an interesting clan to play as in this starting point. Because you have to deal with Hideyoshi sooner or later. And the Shimazu. And then you have the Mori. I mean, it's just all powerful neighbors. The Mori have an alliance with Hideyoshi for another year. So if this run doesn't work, I think maybe the goal of the run should be to uh, wait. Hold out, just like we're doing. But wait for an opportunity for the Mori and the Hashiba to go to war. Because right now, I'm drawing these western... These western lands are all marching all the way over here. Like, he's free to send troops all the way over here. And punch punch out the Chosokabe at the same time. If the Mori would go to war against the Hashiba... Then I wouldn't be under so much pressure. You know what I mean? Right now, it's just a little bit too much pressure. Okay. Nothing to do but wait. Let's reassign these guys, the, the guys that lost the uh, castle. I don't even have anywhere to put them, and I have hardly any officers. It's kind of funny, because it's like, I hardly have any officers left, but I have such little space that <laughs> we're shrinking so quickly. Alright. The Tokugawa can provide me with 5,000. 5,000 is great. I'll take that. I should have captured this. I don't know why I didn't capture this to slow them down. Mm, making a lot of mistakes. Making a lot of mistakes. And when you can't... Uh, when the stakes are this high, you can't make any mistakes at all, really. So it just feels... It feels really brutal. It feels especially brutal. You know, if you're if you're a better force or in a better position, you don't even you don't even think about some of these mistakes, but... You have, when you have to operate at very high efficiency, you feel it. The only person really helping is going to be... What is he doing? Okay, he's helping this clan stay alive. Alright. At least uh, Ieyasu is doing something, man. This is a really fun scenario, though. So if... If I can't, oh my god, if I can't survive this, I'm going to retry it. So, okay, they already know what to do. They're putting down. Okay, his forces have changed direction now that he's captured the castle. We could actually retake this. What if we march and retake that castle? I have to beat this guy down first. Let's get this, these guys off our front lawn. Then I can retake the castle, and then I can negotiate with Hideyoshi for it. And get a truce. I really just need time to build up my forces. Uh, 
Um, who's here? Tokuhime? Oh, because of the rebellion. Oh my god. Wow, perfect time to have revolt break out. Absolutely backbreaking. I'm gonna send this guy out. Because he has confused. We could capture uh, Shigehide from Saika. That'd be great. We're hard up on leaders in this force. Where's his tribe at? 500. I wish tribes restored a little bit quicker. Alright, they're not going to attack. What are they waiting on? Help. You've got 1,000 here, 1,000 from Masanori. Yeah, let's let them get a little closer. Maybe we can fight all four. This is still a relatively small battle. I just can't let it get too crazy, you know what I mean? Yasu's on the way. Oh, what is going on? Oh, Mazuyuki. Okay. Let's watch this while I collect my damn thoughts. <laughs> Masayuki was like a real life troll. Trolling the Tokugawa. I wonder if a 1584 Masayuki playthrough would be harder than, uh, than Sekigahara. I think... I want to say the, the Masayuki playthrough I'm doing right now is, is more uh, difficult. Than this one. Well, everyone's running by this guy, and he's still standing there screaming. The fear of the Sanada. Sanada to Tokugawa. Ryoke no Nagaki Innen wa koko ni hajimaru no de ar.
That just makes me want to keep going on my Mazuyuki playthrough. That playthrough is just... It's, you know, it just as I'm starting to take off on that one, now I've got the Toyotomi kind of closing in. Oh, man. All right. Arcade, you think Terramoto's busy fighting Sorin? We could check. All right, we can skip that. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, Sorin's been... Oh, he's still around. He's still got Tachibana Castle. Okay, so he's holed up his forces. It looks like the Mori and the Shimazu are pretty much fighting for control of Kyoshu. How much longer do they have with Hideyoshi? Ten months left. Wow, that feels like forever. All right. Let's let these two guys get close enough to be in the battle. And then I'm going to try to fight a battle against them. Try to win it. We also need... Uh, Ieyasu to get over here. Let me build something, too. Our income's been shot to pieces. Okay. I don't know how close they have to be. So we win this battle, then we use these forces here to retake Nagashima, and then we try to broker a truce and buy time so that hopefully the Mori uh, and the Hashiba go to war. That'll pull his western forces. Okay, I think I have to get Nobukatsu out here. Um, yeah, put him in the unit, might as well. Beef it up a little bit. Speeds down, yep. Okay. Let's see. We don't have them yet, okay. Ooh, I can't, I can't go back because of this guy. Damn it. Got it. I don't know exactly where the boundaries are for when they're considered to be part of it, so... Kind of guesstimating right now. Oh, he's just decided to charge. Okay, there it is. There it is. So I'm going to hide in the castle. I'm going to hide in the castle, wait for Masanori to cross this little uh, river there. Going to lose most of my forces, but... This guy's not ready to do anything. Golly. Steps are horrendous. Alright. Okay. That's got to be close enough. Nine units. <laughs> Okay, so what we have to do is we have to capture somebody in this battle. Winning's not enough. Authority's not enough. We need to capture Masanori and kill him. Um, what's his name? The guy from Saika. We have to capture somebody. Not enough to win.
Ieyasu's close enough. Okay, that's great. What's up, Ikari? Yeah, we lost the castle. It's uh, I'm going to try to retake it if I can fight a successful battle. But at this point, it's like fighting to regain territory. It's not a good look. It's not great. Okay, that's good. So I want to try to capture Shigehide, Masanori. This guy's going to mess us up real bad. He's got concerted attack. Let's get Tokugawa out in the front. Tribe unit over there. That's where uh, Nobukatsu is going to head. Even with everything going on, I'm still going to try to raise Nobukatsu stats. <laughs> I'm still worried about... Okay, how do I get him his commendations to beef up his attack power? You know what I mean? Like, I'm still committed to that. Alright, let's do this. So what I'm going to try to do is just basically survive for 10 months maybe get a truce get a truce done and um, go back to war when the Mori Alliance is up with the Hashiba because if the Hashiba and the Mori go to war then I won't have to deal with all those forces uh, in the west Right now, I'm dealing with, like, four different regions at the same time. All right, let's threaten the camp. Let's just completely surround this guy. No, uh, I, I gotta keep him alive. He's got confused. So we'll send this guy in. He's firing away. Go for the camp. Oh no, this is no, no, no. We're not doing that. Run, Nobukatsu, run! Okay. What's up, Kira? Nothing much, man. We're trying to survive. Is he cut off? Oh, he's dead. He's dead. I mean, I could try to help him and save him, but it ain't gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Maybe our confused guy can get over there. So I'm trying to capture Masanori. I'm trying to capture uh, Shigehide. I'm trying to get somebody 
strong on my force. That's all I'm trying to do. I don't have any leaders. I don't have anybody that's, you know what I mean? Like a one-man wrecking crew. You can just uh, get off of here. Just get away from this guy. He's going to use his concerted attack. Is there any direction you can go? Alright, there we go. That concerted attack does a lot of damage sometimes. Like, if it's if you have a couple of units, you can easily lose two, 3,000 units. It's insane. Okay, he's gonna... Yeah, he's, he's just gonna stay and defend the camp. I just can't take that. Oh. oh, okay. I thought that was gonna give me uh, way too much. We gotta catch them all. That's right. Let's catch one, even. Oh, oh, here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now let's get this sucker. Let's not eat a Spear of Dawn before he takes off. The real prize will be uh, Shigehide. So I have a suspicion that Masanori is actually going to be loyal to the Toyotomi. I think our guy is going to break. Alright, let me pull him back. There we got him. Okay, that's two. Okay, we didn't get Masanori, but we captured another guy. That's two people. Let's get Nobukatsu involved. I'm actually trying to get Nobukatsu stats up in this run, so. Even if I can get him up by like 10, you know what I mean? 10 is good. Okay. Where's Ieyasu? He's got fixed fire. That means, uh... That means you're up, Tokugawa, actually. Yeah, you're up, Ieyasu. That's all you, bud. Yeah, we need a policy that increases that. They usually have one in ev in most of these games. Romance has it. Past Nobunaga games used to have it. Alright. We took the hit. We're gonna withdraw. Confuse. Alright, yeah, so we get it. You're a big deal. We're gonna confuse. Confuse and swarm. Actually, I'm gonna send him in his attacks. He's got higher attack. 72. Okay, never mind. All right, give me a capture. Come on. Oh, oh we killed somebody. All right, I'll take that. All right, now I need to uh, retake my castle. Mm, they're both pretty damn loyal. Just let him go. Catch and release.
Okay, now let's go try to retake our castle here. Confuse abuse, you're with me. I don't know if the Tokugawa forces are going to withdraw, though. I don't remember. Do they withdraw? Do they have to get to the base first? I have no idea. Don't you dare leave, Tokugawa. You stay right there. Why aren't you repressing? Here, you can repress. No provisions, good lord. Too much damage. Can't even storm, too much damage. Okay. The one time it's not working in my favor, I actually need Mitsunari to engage here, and he's not. Come on, Nagamasu. Alright. <laughs> oh, but Mitsunari's never gonna leave Hideyoshi. That sucks. Mitsunari's never going to leave, and I'm not willing to execute Mitsunari. I'm team uh, Ishida, for sure. I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah, it's an unending struggle. This is a really fun run, you know? I can't stress it enough. It is a lot of fun. Like, even right now, I can see a lot of ways to where I can get out of this situation. But I need, like, three or four things to go right. And uh, for me personally, like, that's where I like my odds to be, you know. I don't just want to be bailed out with one successful thing. I want to have to work, like, two to three different mini miracles to then have a chance to maybe get out of the situation that I'm in. You know what I mean? That's where, I'm, that's where I have the most fun in these types of games. And right now, what I need to happen is I need to... Take my castle, force a truce with Hideyoshi on my terms, which would mean that I'd have to take one of his castles and then hold out until the Mori, until the Mori go to war with the Hashiba, which is nine months. So we're just holding out for a future, for the possibility of something developing in the future. Hang on, hang on. Mitsunari's gonna hit us with his, uh... Where's, uh... Where's Tokugawa? Oh, there he is. You're up, bud. Who's got the highest attack here? You do. So we need a lot of things to go right. Even in my other playthrough, the Mazayuki playthrough, 
I mean, I'm winning against uh, Ieyasu in that, but the Toyotomi are starting to encroach on my territory, so I'm on a time clock on that too, where it's like, I have to win these very efficient battles. Otherwise, we're gonna I'm gonna be uh, overwhelmed by the Toyotomi. I'm gonna be too weak in that. All right, let's confuse him. Confuse not ready. There we go. That's what we like to see. Crippled. Yeah, Kira, your run, um... For everybody watching, Kira's got a channel. He's also uploading content. He's got the Brothers Revolt DLC, which is, uh, I'm insanely jealous of because I really wanted to play that, uh scenario but we don't have it we don't regular uh us regular plebs don't have access to that one but uh definitely check out his run on his channel ikari you're still doing the ujizane run right so ikari's got a run as well so definitely check out those guys but yeah the uh the brothers revolt man your run is pretty uh pretty desperate you've been able to do what i'm hoping to do is is um give ground sure but improve my roster while i'm giving ground that's what you've been able to do you've been able to slowly steadily improve your uh, officer core in your brother's revolt run because of uh katsue's rumor which is weird that katsue actually got you so many rumor successful rumor triggers like covert triggers because he can charge his attack a lot faster now which is perfect for Ketsue so you're in a really cool spot in that like I said your roster's gotten a lot better you've been able to get a lot of good officers even though you don't have a lot of territory and you're still getting kind of pushed around but I, I think the most important part in this game when you're a small force is to get good officers get the kind of guys who can win you the big battles you know who give you a chance if you have like a lot of bad officers I mean, you just, it, it just, it's so much more difficult, man. It's so much worse. I think I'm going to switch. Should I switch these guys? I don't know. I don't know when the Tokugawa forces are going to leave. They're still hanging out. I don't know who they're waiting on. These guys? No. Is it this guy? They still took the castle. Wow. They, they, they still took it. Even with Ieyasu uh, sending reinforcements, they still took this clan's castle. I'm too far to participate in the battle. All right. We're going to have to run over here. Okay, okay. Well, if he's going to do that, if he's going to do that, then I'm going to get back to work over here. Because the AI's got to chew through one, two hexes to get to here. So I'm going to get back to work. Maybe we'll pull some of the forces off. Should we storm it? I think we have to storm it. I'm gonna get Nobukatsu out of here, though. Okay. We'll take it. That old man doesn't inspire any confidence in me, but we'll take it. Oh, 
The Toyotomi are doing everything. They're stirring up rebellion. They're sabotaging our castles. I mean, they're throwing everything that they have at us. I need to take this, man. Are you not going to take this? Defense is 212. No, you're not going to take it. <sighs> Just blockade until he gets there. And then run away. Blockade and run away. Just run away. Expand market. How much would that give me? Not much, right? 96. Yeah, it's cheaper to just build a trade town still. If this run fails, I, I'm going to attempt it again, in case anyone's wondering. I'm starting to see a pattern where, like, when you're playing as these very small forces against, like, a third of the map, you have... I think what's got to happen is you have to make... You have, like, a small window where you can quickly gain against these forces. But once they start to uh, just build up, it, that window starts to disappear, you know? You see what I'm saying? These forces are coming from all the way over there. And that's because the Hashiba have an alliance with the Mori. And they have a... Uh, well, they don't have an alliance with the Chosokabe. But the Chosokabe kind of got knocked out of the war. I don't know if they've built up yet. They're trying to build up. But they, got, they pretty much got knocked out of the war. Because they had to fight... They had a Shimazu invasion. Chosokabe. I have to try the Chosokabe in this scenario. Because this seems really difficult as well. You have the island. But you have the Toyotomi land over here. And you have the Shimazu over here. And if you want to head north. You have to deal with the Mori. So there are no good options. But I think it would be fun to play as the Chosokabe. Build up a, a naval force. And invade the, uh, the Hashiba. Like at the right time. Wait for an opportunity and just invade. I think that'd be kind of cool. I need help, man. I'm dying here. What's up, Daniel? Yeah, Kira's uh, Brothers Revolt is very, very good. There's Kira's won like three battles that are just like they don't they look unwinnable. And then he manages to win them. So he just keeps... he just He's just doing the rope-a-dope defense. You know what I mean? He's Muhammad Ali. He's just rope-a-dope over and over again. Every time that, the, that it looks like he's going to take a fatal blow, he escapes. He gets out of it. So... Yeah, the Mazuyuki run's really good. The only thing is I'm running out of time in that because... As I'm as I'm starting as I'm trying to take over Ieyasu, the Toyotomi are starting to creep up on me, so I have to quickly overtake the Tokugawa and build up the Sanada clan. If the Toyotomi move in and I'm still recovering from the war against the Tokugawa, then I mean it, that run could also fail. Your fights are the opposite. <laughs> well, I've been there. Okay, so who do we have here? Yoshitsugu is an absolute terror in this game. Absolute terror. Two, two ways to confuse you. Double confuse abuse. Somebody at Kuwait thought they were being, uh, thought it'd be funny to give somebody double with two different ways to confuse you. Probably thought that shit was funny when they were developing it. He'll confuse you as a tactic, and then he'll confuse you when he's routed. 
Sick minds. Sick minds at Koei. Alright. Rebellions are put down. I don't see any way to retake my castle, but I need to. I need to retake my castle. But first, let's try to capture some more officers. I need a great leader. You know, I didn't need to send them out. If I win this authority trigger, I'll get... I should retake these. That's one of the things I make a mistake. It's like, if you know you're going to get an authority trigger, don't march out your guys. Leave them on your castle. Save your supplies. Especially when you don't have any supplies. Oh, shit. Okay, let's scrape the barrel. Scrape the barrel. 900, sure. All right. How are we looking now? Like we might win. Okay. We'll take it. Yeah, your Shitsugu run could be good. The way the AI just kept stopping the Toyotomi was kind of crazy. I don't think he has any more officers, though. That's the only problem with that run. Is I think he's by himself. He, maybe he has a handful of officers. Yeah, ooh, that's a tribe unit. Great. Tribe units are your breaking points in this game. That's where you look to break. That's where you can punch a hole, just like, uh, I don't know, football, basketball, sports ball, all the sports balls. That's you, There's a point, you always look for a point where you can break through and put pressure. And tribe units are that in this game. Where can I safely use Nobukatsu? Tokugawa forces, where are they? This guy. Is that, is that it? And this guy, okay. Center. Let's put him here. Confuse. One officer with Confuse on our team. Okay. Yeah, it's going to be hard to capture Yoshitsugu because of that. Although, he's probably a Hashiba loyalist, right? So he's not going to switch sides. I'd have to execute him. He's like Mitsunari. He's not going to switch sides. All right, let's get around this guy. Seal him off. Hmm. This is a problem. Can I send him around? I think I should send the other guy around. He's got speedy. Oh, he's taking the wrong route. Too late to escape, now you face the mighty Nobukatsu. The true heir to ambition. Whatever shall you do against Nobukatsu? Okay, I can't do shit here. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna get out of there. Really? But we just started. Oh, he's pincered. Man, I messed that up big time. We got a little too elaborate. Just threw away 1,500 soldiers. 
Just threw them in the trash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Are you gonna chase them? What's your problem? I don't want any trouble. <laughs> All right, you take the camp. Um, you get ready to deal with Yoshitsugu, I guess. Hey, 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 I don't want any trouble, man. What the fuck? I guess this, this guy does not like him. Where do we use this confused guy? I guess here, but his soldiers are so low. Calculating genius. Soldiers and confusion. Is there a better combination in the whole game? Don't think so. This guy's never turning around. Well, if we have to win by a camp, we'll win by camp. That's not how I like to win, but... I'm losing soldiers and... Uh, this guy won't turn around. Man, what is this guy's problem? What's up, Michael? Uh, with multiplayer, what you would do is uh, do what you do, what they did in Taishi. I don't know if you played Taishi, but I started playing it the other day, and Taishi has a pause, kind of like a turn-based. So you you give an order, and then you you end your turn. So that's how they would do multiplayer. Everybody gives their orders in this battle. Like you give your orders, and then you'd hit a button to end your turn, and then the enemy would do the same thing. So the other player would end his turn, and then when the turn was over. The timer would go. You'd have like time would advance by a set amount, and then it would pause again. And then each player would give their orders. It'd be perfect because you couldn't see what every what the other guy's orders are. So you'd have to really like. Yeah, pause and play wouldn't work, but you'd have to do a turn-based system. But they used to do it in the past games. Um, the Romance series used to have multiplayer, used to have hot seat multiplayer back in the day. Have we almost broken that camp? Alright, because I'm tired of... Uh, I'm just losing soldiers right now. Alright. Not Probably my least favorite way to win, but I'll take it.
Yeah, I started doing the battles in Taishi. I mean, they're... I don't know. I don't know yet. It's not... Um... I don't know how I feel about them yet, so I haven't played them enough. But I do see what you mean about them taking too long. Because uh, once your units run out of morale, you have to wait for them to regain their morale. And so there's a lot of running back and forth. So what I'm hoping is that in Taishi, there's some kind of way to build your forces to, um, to have an answer for that. All right, here we go. Let's go retake our castle. Scrape up wherever you can. I'm going to retake the castle. And then I'm going to try to bring the Hashiba to the, to the table. To the bargaining table. Taishi does have some interesting things though. Like the resolve. I really like the resolve mechanic. Like each warlord has a different uh, buffs that you can unlock based on, you know, c completing their specific goals. I haven't seen that in any other game where you have, like, uh, different tiers of, uh, I don't know, just buffs is the best way I could put it. Faction powers that you unlock. Just storm it, man. At this point, just storm it. Storm it successfully. Oh my god. Thank you. It's getting too close. Okay, yeah. Talk to me about Tokai. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we'll get right on that. We'll get right on that. We'll just overthrow the Hashiba. We'll take out the Tokugawa. No problem. <gasps> Serve? Somebody wants to work for us? Oh yeah, he's an idiot. That makes sense. Only an idiot would join up with this cause right now. Alright, so this, this is how we're looking, guys. This is how we're looking. I know it looks grim, but look, Hideyoshi's got 75,000 soldiers. He is running out of steam. He is running out of steam. 75k across all this territory is very, very, very weak. So. There, there should be a window to do something. The key thing is the Mori. We need the Mori to break the alliance with the Hashiba. They need to invade or something. They need to start fighting. Alright, I'm going to try to uh, negotiate. We're going to give him the castle. Which is really my castle. If he tells me to get rid of the Tokugawa, he's, he can fuck right off. Is that all? Oh, no. 46. Okay. Gee, I'm not giving you my horse. Fucking crazy. It's a nice horse. Here, we'll give you this castle. There you go. Truce for 12 months. 12 months is all I need. I just need to come up for, for air. You know what I mean? This this guy's like a bully right now. He's He's been holding me... He's been holding me and giving me a swirly in the toilet for this whole run. I just need to... I need a moment to come up, take a breath. You know? And then I can fight him. And I can keep fighting him. Alright, I think this is the best deal I'm going to get. We're going to take it. come on, Jero. 12 month truce. 12 months to build up. 12 months to, uh. I don't know. We might die at the end of the 12 months. I'm not gonna lie to you. Can we break a truce? Can you break a truce? No, I can submit. I'm not doing that. Tokugawa's gonna get a break.
Okay, so if we're in a truce, we can march through each other's territory, right? So if we're in a truce and I wanted to I'll go up here, for example, I could do that. If I wanted to go fight the Maida, I could do that. Uh, Nari Mas is still around somehow. Okay. Alright guys, I'll be back in one second. I'm going to get a refill real quick. Uh, if you guys haven't subbed to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel. I've got a Mazayuki run going. I'm going to start covering Tai Chi, but it's not going to be as much as this game. But I'm going to cover it here and there. And uh, don't forget to like the stream. I'll be right back. Twelve months. Twelve months and then it'll be pretty much out, all out war. So what I can do... Oh, do I also... So you make a truce with the vassals, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. But wait. The Uesugi submitted to the Hashiba? Yeah, 
Everybody's caved. Everybody's caved. The Uesugi have surrendered to the Hashiba, which brings the Sanada to also surrender to... Holy shit. I don't even have anywhere I can strike. I was going to strike at his allies and start dismantling his network. That's what I was going to do in those 12 months. Oh, man. I hate the vassal system. It's trash. doesn't work. Like a true vassal system, people should leave. You know what I mean? That status. Like, if I kill Hideyoshi, Hidetsugu takes over. Everyone who's a vassal... There should be a percentage of people who just break because that's how it happened in history. It's like the vassal, making someone a vassal, you were only as strong as the leader was. You know, as soon as the person who had the strength to bind all those vassals together dies, it'd be chaos again. I don't even know what this is. So, if I fight a battle against Hideyoshi and I kill Hideyoshi, you know, there should be an effect where if it's a medium authority or if Hideyoshi dies, then some of the factions that agree to submit to him should break because his power is starting to wane, for example. In this game, it's like, okay, the Toyotomi have made the Uesugi their vassals. Well, now the Uesugi are just going to be a vassal for the rest of the game. doesn't matter what happens to the Toyotomi. The Toyotomi can shrink to one castle. The Uesugi are still going to be vassals. It's just a big hole in the AI. Big logic. Big logic hole. There should really be a meter that tracks. There should be a meter that tracks... How, um... The independence of a vassal. And how much they want to break out. You know, and if you're unable to hold the reins with your vassals, then they rebel. And become independent again. There should be something like that. Just like history, there should be a hostage situation. Okay, you want to be... You submit, well, send me a hostage. Send me an officer. And then you choose somebody from the list. That person becomes a hostage. You know? They, that's something that they need to flesh out. Because right now, it doesn't... It doesn't work. Like, I get that they're trying to recreate the history of it, but... The actual history of it is like so many people agreed to be a vassal and broke out. The only people that do it, I think, is uh, I think it's just Ieyasu who breaks out because of the event. And even that needs an event. Even Ieyasu needs an event to trigger. He doesn't just do it. You know? It's like that's not a special thing what Ieyasu did. Tons of factions did that. As soon as the people that they were working for, as soon as their power started to slip, they'd break away. That was common back then. I don't know. Maybe if we get a PUK2. Who knows, right? Maybe we'll get a PUK2. That's the rumor. That's the rumor. But this just sucks, because now the Uesugi can just conquer in the Toyotomi's name against the rest of the map. You should be able to turn them off. But the only way to do that is to disable diplomacy, and then... So you have to gut the whole engine, you know what I mean? Just instead of changing a part, the game, the only option is just to gut the whole thing. Damn, so now Uesugi showing up. Yeah, the Mori might just continue the alliance. If they do continue the alliance, I mean, hey. Like I said, all this run is just we're just uh we're just hoping for for an opportunity to do make something happen. But you're right, they could just uh On the other hand, I've never had a chance to build up, so this will be my first chance to build up a force. 
12 months is a long time. I should have done... I wish I could have chosen uh, six months. So you're like, he's going to be able to just call on everybody to beat down Narimasa. Probably to submit as well. It's trash. I think what I should have done is I should have just um, broken all the vassals in the beginning of the game. Hideyoshi's got vassals with everybody in the beginning. Well, with most, with the Maida and uh, the Niwa clan and the Tsutsui clan. So I, he might as well just conquer them, you know what I mean? You know what? I can just put the speed up at this point. There's nothing. There's nothing. I can't even march. I can't even march and attack his allies, which was my plan. So at least I could work at dismantling his ally network, but I can't even do that because you can't march against the vassals. Okay. Who knows how much longer the Chosokabe are going to hang uh, survive. I thought that would give me friendly. Nope, they stayed normal. Chosokabe run's got to be really difficult as well. You're on a time crunch here, surrounded by Shimazu and Kyushu. You have the Mori above you, and then you have the Toyotomi. Man, oh man, what can we do? What can we do? Yeah, I appreciate it, Abedi. Yeah, I mean, to me, as long as I get a couple of people that show up to watch, then I'll just keep uploading. Because uh, I'm going to keep playing the game anyway. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, yeah, they're going to move to take out these guys. The Mori have an alliance for four more months. So we're going to see what happens before my truce is over. We'll see what happens with the Mori. I don't think I can negotiate with them, though. They're too far away. Oh, no, we can. Can we send a diplomat? I thought there was a limit. Am I thinking of the right game? So I can send somebody, but there's just no way. They're extremely hostile for some reason. Why would you be hostile with one of the few forces that's trying to hold back the tide? Michael, I totally agree with you. So I stopped playing the games in the... Uh, I stopped playing the games around the PS2 era. And... Um, so I came back with Romance 14. That's my first game back into the series. And I liked 14, but it's got some problems. But, I mean, just, just look at my channel. I mean, I put up so much 14 content, it's crazy. I've played a lot of 14, and a lot of the runs in 14 are just like this. They're just small force, small odds, like, trying to hold back everything. Because that's, that's the way that I like to play. But 14 had some problems. And the DLC, the power-up kit for 14, was a huge disappointment. It was a, just a massive letdown. And also, that game... Um, in my opinion, 14 doesn't lend itself well to streaming or uploading because it's too slow of a game. It's a very glacial game, so... I uploaded it forever anyway because, you know, that's my... Like I said, my thinking is I'm going to play the game anyway, so... But it doesn't... It really was not a big hit with everybody because it was so slow. And I agree, it was way too slow a game. These games need to be like this, like Awakening. That's what I love about Awakening. It's 
sort of streamlined, but it's still, it's not too streamlined. There's enough there where you can build and get crazy. They let the players have fun in the sandbox. A lot of, sometimes these Koei games don't let you have fun. 14 had that problem where it's like, okay, there's stuff to do in this sandbox, but you're not letting me have fun. You're not letting me do what I want to do. And I don't know why they do that because it's a single player game. You know, if you're going to make a sandbox game, let your players do whatever the hell they want in it. Don't put limitations. Don't make arbitrary rules. You know, don't make stuff that's unfun. Make it as free as you can. But yeah, Awakening for me is the first one that feels like that. You can jump in, play five years of game time in like three hours. You could do a run in an afternoon. Are the Chosokabe going to be wiped out? I'm pretty sure this is this is towards them. This is my fear taking the truce. Yeah. Is he sieged up? Maybe he holds out and he pulls out a siege win. I think we just doomed everybody else by taking the deal. <laughs> I think we just cre recreated history for Nobukatsu. I think we doomed the rest of the map by taking the deal. Why is this guy building a supply station? Are you insane? He's lost his he's lost his damn mind. Supply station to where? He's building supply stations for the Toyotomi. That's what he's doing. He's thinking ahead. He's like, well, when Nobukatsu falls, Hideyoshi shows up, I'll have this nice supply station built for him on his way to Ieyasu. That's what he's doing. Yeah, we freed up his forces. That's what I like about this game. There's this meta that plays out when you're fighting that you have to be conscious of. Where, it, where you have to know how you're affecting other forces. You just have to be aware that that you're actually affecting things everywhere else and vice versa. What's going on everywhere else is actually going to affect you. Yeah, the Chosokabi are done. They're going to get carved up. Everybody's gonna get a piece of the island, looks like. Let's sell some supplies. We don't need them. We're not marching anywhere. Sell them all. I don't care. Let's just get some stuff buffed up if we can. Oh, we're already building that. Okay. I'm really hoping that uh, the Romance 8 remake has multiplayer, but we'll see. Because original Romance 8 had multiplayer. So I really hope they don't just leave that feature out for no reason. Because it should be a simple copy-paste job. And that goes for all their features with 8. Most of it should be copy-paste, and 8 was a pretty good game in the series. What's up, Desert? Spear of Influence? Yeah, Spear of Influence is good too. It just, it's kind of slow. It takes a little bit to get off the ground. And the, the battle system, I feel like, is not too strong. It's still decent, but it's not. want a fee for a number of years that's only 76 who is this guy I don't know what that does you can just go I'm gonna give Taishi like a really good shot I'm gonna figure out the combat system figure out the viability of small forces, you know. What what kind of things you can do with the engine. 
And if I like it, then uh, I'm probably going to try that. But I also want to get back to Spear of Influence at some point, too. Like I said, Spear is good, but it does take a little while to get going. I feel like it's the superior game. Well, it is the superior game for storytelling, though. Like, if you like doing quests, reenacting history, Spear of Influence is where it's at. It's the best one for that. It's got a lot of content. I don't even think Koei is going to ever try to top that. Like, I doubt that they'll ever try to top Spear. They'll probably try to build their future games more in this style. It's like they outdo themselves and then they scare themselves. They're like, oh shit, let's not even, uh, let's not even try to top that. Let's just build in a different direction and hope that people don't notice that we're not really imp improving. <laughs> Technically, it's like, let's hope they don't notice. Yeah, I can't break the truce. I wish I could. If I could break the truce, I would. Our truce ends in two months. Okay, we're back to the... Okay, we're back in it. Oh, man. I'm just going to advance very quickly and retake these castles. Very quickly. Yeah, let's let's maybe we should have a mediate in our back pocket. Let's do that. Tokugawa arrested, I assume. Should we send the Tokugawa to attack Toba while we make a dash for Minnow? We make a play for these three. I think that might be what to, the move here. I've never had my territories built up so much in this whole playthrough. Let me see. Can I afford another policy? This is all we got. This is all we've been surviving with. Dawn of Revolution, Call of the Scholar Monk, my favorite so far. Just because of XP, I love officer growth in these games. Um, and uh, system reform, of course. Which, honestly, in hindsight, wasn't that good. System Reform 2 will be better, I guess. We need two people. Damn. We need two people. Who else? Goodwill, Goodwill. Wait a minute. I think we're still wasting Goodwill with the Chosokabe. I think it's safe to say that... We can pull back our, uh, our emissary. Okay. Two months left. What's the quickest route to Ogaki? Should we, should we bulldoze past Gifu Castle? Okay. I don't have provisions either. I sold them. I guess I could sell my horse and buy some provisions. Okay, how much? How many? How many days? Where are we? Truce with for one month. The Mori have a truce for ten days. They haven't renewed the alliance, so that means they're not going to. Should be war between the Mori and the Toyotomi. They've only added 30,000 soldiers. But I'm worried about their allies. I'm not worried about them. Their allies are the ones that can just kick back and build up. Uh, let me see... You did a war ban. Yeah, I saw that in the tutorial for Taishi. If you win so much of the map, you can force... You can become so powerful in Taishi that you just demand that all the other daimyo stand down. That's the way to win the game.
Yeah, I'm pawning off my getaway horse for some food. Feels bad. Okay, let's gather. We give the commands. Oh my god, he's trash. Oh, I forgot how, I forgot I have trash at the top. I have trash at the very top of my castles, except for Nagamasu. Nagamasu's at least got culinary diplomacy. Ooh, 50-50. I will take those odds. I've taken worse odds. Alright. We'll give it a... This is probably our last gasp. Our last gasp at relevancy. Okay, this is mine right here, right? We'll hit Gifu from two directions. We'll send the good forces that way. This guy with his trash 3,000. Oh, you know what? At least he gets him up to 40. This guy's stats are base 20. You know what's kind of frustrating too? This guy has refined taste and I have another officer who has refined taste. Nobody's found me any treasure. Usually I hit on that once. In at least three years I hit on that once. And I kind of count on it. Because it can give you a little bit of burst economy. I know I'm getting a little bit down the rabbit hole, you know what I mean? But when you're when you're slumming it with a force like Nobukatsu, you kind of end up getting down the rabbit hole with, with what can possibly save you. And for me, refined taste is one of those things that I'm like, refined taste, it should trigger. That's going to give me, uh, I don't know, 2,000 gold. That's that's something. I can do something with that, you know. Okay. Actually, hold on. You can wait. Let's wait. Let's try to do this right. Save provisions as much as possible. Let the backland advance. Okay. Now we deploy a uh, Nagoya. I think you guys are about to watch me possibly take three castles. And then probably give up three castles. <laughs> okay. So you go that way. Nagamasu. I'm not sure what to do with Nagamasu. I feel like... I don't know. Yeah, I'm not too sure what to do with Nagamasu. Maybe send him towards Gifu? But this guy's off by himself. I don't know. He doesn't have that many supplies, though, right? I guess we'll send him here since it's a shorter. Not that many supplies, yeah. Okay. days do we have left truce uh it still says one month maury's truce is up maybe they'll start invading i can't tell what's going on here oh they still haven't lost this castle here that's weird Chosokabe are probably going to submit at some point, right? That's the reality of it. Okay. 
We're in position. I have 14,000. Yeah, okay, sure. Let's buy some food. Do I even need Nobukatsu to deploy? I don't think so. At least not immediately, so I'm not going to deploy him. Try to develop what we can. How many more days? 15 days. That's kind of a long time. I guess we'll see if I find an officer. Still not done with the policy. Running out of supplies already? Alright. Truce is ended. I think I'm going to have Ieyasu attack here. Toba seems is just as viable as well. I don't know if it's better to get him to start fighting here on this border or to try to destabilize uh, the actual garrison in, in Minnow because these are the only two spaces. I'm going to say here. He's pretty close to it too. Let's see. Still not fighting each other. Just carving up the Chosokabe clan. What a shame. Tadawak is coming this way, so we'll have to beat him down first. Sansa Burro. Reputation, refined taste. That's three guys with refined taste. The networking pays off. Oh shit, look at that. That's a disaster. Oh, I just bring him. Sansa Burrow's too late. I thought he'd be able to save us, but I think he's too late. Oh, 
しましょうかの血を我らが手に白攻めを始めるぞ Where are these guys heading toward? Gifu Castle? I'm not winning this battle. There is no way. Um. So, so, ni show up, she. Oh shit, all right. Oh, okay, he's heading over there. Shit. 17 days, yeah, he'll make it. He'll make it over there. All right. It looks like we're just gonna have to bet it all. Just fine by me. They have more talent, of course. Whoa, whoa, we don't have to storm. What are we doing? Are you guys crazy? Lost her damn minds. Oh, there's just a lot of talent. There's a lot of talent here, fellas. Kiyomasa, Hidemasa. I've beaten these guys before, but they... They didn't have soldiers before. They actually have units now. This guy's probably not going to take that in time. Probably going to have to call him back. Let's go. Okay. Do we have everybody? This is it? This is all the power we can muster? Let me just take in the map one last time. All right. Let's hand out any commendations. There we go. Now we're now we're officially we're basically Napoleon after uh, Waterloo. Not Waterloo after uh, after his retreat from Russia. He had a special ceremony to uh, hand out medals and commendations for his veterans because he knew his empire was about to come cr crashing down around him. Okay, uh, medium authority when we're re defeated. Medium authority, so that's complete. That's the end of the run. Okay, let's put it. Let's put it on the line. No, oh, we're not gonna let him pass. No, no way, bro. Let him pass by. We are determined to be a thorn on somebody's side. 
Is that a second camp up there? Is that a second little camp? Looks like it. Right when I find Sansaburo. 15 years old, so I guess I wouldn't have gotten him anyway, though. Kind of reminds me of uh, surviving as Nagamasa so that Mitsunari could show up. That's that's what the Sansaburo felt like. Discovering him so late. All right, this is winnable. We just have to divide and conquer. Um, Nobukatsu is going to have to really fight. He's going to have to really fight in this one. He's holding a lot of our soldiers down. No confuse, right? Speedy, healer. You know, maybe that was my mistake. Maybe I should have sent Ieyasu to attack Toba. Then these forces wouldn't be marching through. She's got Speedy. She could probably get... Yeah, she'd probably get over there the quickest. One unit in reserve. Let's see, who do we got? Who's hanging back? Oh, the tribe unit. Yeah, what the hell would I do with the tribe? Unit? What what is what's the tactic? Potential, yeah, that's that's not great. Danamon's got speedy. I think Nobukatsu needs to be in the front. He needs to lead by example. What did uh you know, like they told the, uh, what's his name, uh, Edward the Fourth or the Third, the Black Prince. His retainers were worried about them putting Edward on the front line so young, and he said, let the boy, he said, let the boy win his spurs. Like, let him prove himself a man. Put him on the front lines. I don't know what to do with this 800 right here. I think maybe the 800 should be over here. Because I feel like this guy's going to head this way. And so we'll sneak our guys around, put pressure on the camp. We can get here and here. No. Yeah, we'd have to get both of these points to force a one-on-one. -on -one. Okay, do we need to be watch out for anything? Potential, gear, um, rapid destruction, musket level 5, Kiyomasa. Kiyomasa might carve us up. What does this guy have? Okay, rapid assault. All right. Nobukatsu will decide his fate. Alright, Tokuhime. The Black Widow of the run. She has personally taken five samurai heads. Personally. Now we're sending her undercover. Okay, this is interesting. Very interesting. Mission failed. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's ford. Cross the ford. Absolutely nobody here. What can you do? Stamina reduction. Speedy's over here. Anybody have Speedy here? Healer. Speedy, but he's got 2,000 soldiers. Alright, let's go. Let's get in position to seal this off. Go, 
So we're gonna try to get a speedy person to shoot up the space here towards the camp. Try to pin uh, Kiyomasa back. Kiyomasa is the real threat on this map. I'm not sure what to do with this guy, but he has stamina reduction, which is not bad. Perturb is like... It can be as good as Confused because you can essentially kill a unit. Alright. So they're both heading this way. That's going to leave Nagamasu to try to hold the spot with his 36 defense. What we can do is set up a pincer. Okay. We'll set up a damn pincer then. I don't trust Nagamasu. I don't I don't think he's gonna last at all. But I need the speed. Gotta go fast. Look how long these guys are taking. We can properly just hold this bridge one spot. Run a rotation. Is this rapid assault ready? No? Okay, so we'll keep him back. So this rapid assault's at full strength. Danamon can hold the bridge here. Yoshitaka can just hang out in the middle. We have to stop these guys. Okay. So we've got a pincer point set up here. Problem is that he's awful, so he's probably gonna break. We're gonna head for the camp. This has fallen. We're gonna shoot the space. Speedy. We're gonna head for the camp. Just standard uh, Napoleonic divide and conquer tactics. Okay, so they're almost about to show up, so I'm gonna try to... Oh, I pulled them back too far. I think I fucked it up already. Yeah, we fucked it up. We fucked up the choke point. Damn. One on one is nowhere near as effective. Look at the stat differential. He's got double my stats. Alright, I'm gonna have to move him down. This guy's gonna crumple. I'm gonna need him. Okay, he's heading for that to defend the camp. I'm just gonna stand here and start beating down this tribe unit. It's doing me a favor. Because I have to deal with it anyway. He's going to walk into me. Instead of me having to go get him. That's fine. Do me a favor. Can I get a pincer here? Or is it too weird? No pincer. Alright. No reason for you to be there. So we could take the camps, but um, I don't just want to take the camps and get the authority win. I want to destroy these forces. So I might take one camp. Ooh, we got the pincer. All right. Nobukatsu is going to be exhausted in a second, but we got the pincer. This guy's at least got 81 attack. Enemy attack is decreased. This tactic is ready to go. Just in time, because Nobukatsu's done. He just took that hit, and he's already finished. What happened? What 
what what happened? He had two thousand soldiers one second. It must have been Kiyomasa, right? Kiyomasa just blew up our forces. I had a feeling, man. I said this guy's gonna blow up my fucking spot. And he did. Wow. He had 2,000 a second ago. That was incredible. Doesn't change anything. I mean, they might... If anything, they might still... Somebody might pull back here. I hope it's not the tribe unit. Okay, it's not the tribe unit, at least. I don't think I can destroy the enemy forces anymore, so I think we have to go for the camps. I think we gotta take the camps. He's leaving to head back to the camp. Yeah, Kiyo Masa's single-handedly just running over my... You know what? I just keep him there. Fuck it. But yeah, he's just blowing up everybody. with Between his concerted attack and his musket fire, he's just killing everybody. I'm moving here to block him off so that they can't retreat. Nagamasu is getting kind of weak. He's not looking too hot. Hmm, okay. Alright, I guess we got... We're gonna win the battle, but... We didn't really do anything. We'll win the battle, we'll get the castle hopefully, but... Let me just try to spare my soldiers at this point. Oh, ugly win, but a win's a win. Dude, Kiyomasa just, yeah, he, he just fucking blew my spot up. 2,000 soldiers gone in the blink of an eye. Tokugawa, you are welcome. <laughs> I think I just secured their minnow, the right side of minnow for them.
Okay. Back to base. Uh, back to base. Who else is on the way? Masanori, tribe unit. Oh my god, Yoshitsugu. Give me a break. I think it's safe to say at this point that we're just going to have to uh, try to storm this sucker down. We're not even guaranteed to take anything. Now that I'm looking at it, we're not really guaranteed to take anything. I'm still going to take a lot of damage. This is not going to fall either. Since he's just passing through... Well, maybe I should let him go through then. Let's see. Can we take this castle? Blockading? Are you insane? There's only 60 guys up there. Come on, don't let it be for nothing. We got one. What do you mean you can't serve me? You're Oda. That would make him his uncle, right? Fourth son of Nobushige. Wow, betrayed by your own family. Brutal. I'll let you go for father's sake. All right, we got a castle. Tokugawa are working on this front, which is just fine by me. If they want to take all that, don't care. How long am I going to hold it for? Not very long. Uh, let's see. Let's put somebody in charge of it. Danamon is probably the best, best person for the job. Good luck, buddy. Does anybody have repair? Oh, there's one. Anybody else have repair? There we go. Alright. Oh, it's the same guy. It was the same guy. He just went to the back of the line. Raised his hand again. Uh, Civil construction. I don't think I can get anything up in this castle in time. Can we beat these forces? Can we get help for these forces? No. We can't beat them either. Five thousand against six, seven, eight. We just take another deal? <laughs> just keep taking castles and making truces. Just cheese our way across the map. Yeah, I mean, I can't beat Masanori. He's got too many soldiers. Is he done taking this? 
He has not taking it. He is not going to take this spot. Everybody's clogged up here. That's shit. What can we do to stop this guy? Can I search? Need a miracle. Okay. Got it. Can go back to base and muster another force. We're low on supplies, though. Is Lamori doing anything? No. I have a suspicion that as soon as my alliance is up with the Chosokabe, they're just going to submit to the to uh, Hideyoshi. I think the only reason they haven't submitted is because the way the uh, the game is scripted, it not scripted. The way the code is written, it can't uh, it can't accept vassalage. It can't submit while it has an alliance with another force, right? It's just the way the rules work. But I think they're going to submit also. I don't know. I think I'm just going to have to pull back. I think I'm just going to have to pull my forces back. I don't think I can beat Masanori. Um. Uji Sato is the second in command. Yeah, I could try to pawn off the castle. What do you guys think? Get another truce? I mean, it's... It's, uh... It's stupid. It's stupid, but it might be the only way to, uh... Make it happen. Alright, so we'll return. Oh, he's not gonna take it. You guys see how bad this guy is? You would think he's out of supplies, but he's not. He's just that bad. What is this guy doing? Where was the forces that were on the way? He had help on the way, didn't he? Now he's by himself. Still too many troops. I would need to field like six units to beat him. Alright, let's just... Can somebody give this guy a hand? Absolute embarrassment. 60 soldiers. How do you lose so many? Oh my god. Alright. You're embarrassing yourself. Hey, have you taken this castle, Ieyasu, or what, man? God. I'm torn. I want to build up on Gifu, but I can't. I just can't. Sansaburo is here. He's been working, uh... He's been working hard in my Mazuyuki run. Okay. What else can we do? I think what I should do is, uh, moving forward, what I sh what I should just implement is, um not allow clans to be vassals you know if a clan becomes an, a vassal just shut that shit down and turn it off you know what I mean because once they're vassals they just never that's it it may as well not exist 
Hideyoshi's on his way with 19,000 soldiers. How I wish I could do something about that. We're still not going to take it. We're not going to take it. We're not going to take it. No. We're not going to take it. Alright, he just left the tribe to do the work. To do the dirty work up there. Where's Sansaburo? You're not gonna take it that easily. That's insulting. He just left the tribe unit. He's like, you guys handle it. What are these guys doing? Oh, they're taking an alternate route. Look at this route. Because we cut. We went right through the middle here. All the way through. Nobukatsu playing the role of third wheel. In the Hideyoshi uh, Tokugawa affair. We're just sticking our noses in where they don't belong, you know. Right in the middle. That, that awkward third wheel, you know what I mean? He's got to go all the way around. The populist tires of war. Well, got bad news for them. Nothing's changing. All right, Hideyoshi. You're just lucky I'm spent. Absolutely spent. We got to build these up. We're going to need probably emergency conscription at some point. You still haven't taken one castle. I'm just... These guys aren't moving. Okay, there goes Naomasa. Ah, his, uh... Of course... And then the Uesugi aren't attacking, so this is this is just gonna build up. Hideyoshi's going for it. All right, we should get forced conscription, though. Right? Two officers came of age. Hirotaka. He's not bad. Moritaka. The Takas. Yeah, they'd rather go all the way around. Hey, refined taste trigger, yes. Extremely late in the game, but I'll take it. There we go, now we can buy some supplies. Um, this medium, we gotta keep some in the back pocket. Okay, so Hideyoshi's attacking. Tokugawa's not done with their attack, which is what's killing me. It's taking in forever. Raise. Uh, none of that's going to help me. Okay. I'm running out of time here. Can you just charge out? Beat him down real quick. All right, what would this be? Two versus two? Mm. 
Yeah, whatever. Okay. All right, guys. I'll be right back. Just gonna get a drink real quick. Might be siege time. You think so, Ikari? You know, the thing about Hideyoshi is that he's the perfect guy, too, to just give a ton of soldiers and send straight at the enemy because his tactic restores his stamina. So right now, I can't just... Like, it, it's a lot more difficult to beat him down with just a small unit spam. Because he's going to actively restore his stamina in the fight. But. It's going to be risky. Let's beat this guy first. We got to get this guy off our porch. He's uh. Loitering around. For some reason. No solicitors at Gifu. Sorry. All right, Nobukatsu, you can uh, another opportunity for you to uh, to do something. Even damage with the tribe unit. Oh man, the shame. Oh, you guys let him get away. What does this guy do? Caution. Okay. I'm very lucky that this guy doesn't have a damage dealing tactic. I didn't, like, it didn't occur to me until right now, but if he had something like concerted attacks. Give me this. To increase my stats. Every little bit's gonna help. Which it's, it's five points in case anybody's wondering. Every time you take a point, you get an Occupy a point, I should say. You get five points total to your stats. Right. That's terrible. He's probably going to destroy him in the charge. Oh, no, he didn't. Okay. I have to assume he's from a castle, so I'm going to try to uh, actually route him. Okay. 
Captured. <sighs> All right. Let's see if we can capture uh, Hideyoshi. these guys going to the Gifu as well okay well one disaster at a time alright so Hideyoshi's coming by himself but beating him is not going to be that simple because of his ability siege preparation They're not allied, but they're not fighting each other. What a shame. And the Tokugawa are just taking forever to take this spot. It should have been like an easy... In my mind, I was thinking it would be an easy win, but this was my mistake right here. I should have sent them to attack Toba. But I thought this would be a simple, uh, simple victory for them. All right. I didn't get forced conscription. That that really hurt. I was expecting that. Are they finally going to take it? Okay, they should take it. Then I can call for help. I can sound the alarm. What spot is this? Oh, no, I can't build it. All right. It's going to take everybody we have to beat Hideyoshi. It's going to take the whole squad. We're going to need Confuse Abuse. And I think I only have one officer that can do that. Let's get rid of some of these guys. I think I have the uh, those two new guys that joined up, so. Uh, yeah, we can put them over there. Alright. Whoops. Okay. These guys, the Taka brothers. Wait, he's not one of them. This guy, right? Moritaka, yeah. Okay. I think he's going for Gifu because look, he's crossed over. We might be able to destroy him. We might be able to get him. Um, once again, I need time. I just don't have it. Or the Tokugawa need to win already. Okay. Nobody has confused. Where's our confusion? Ah. Make your way over, sir. Calm 
confident little bastard. Come on, Tokugawa. I need help. I hate this prompt. Got it. All right. We're just gonna swarm this guy. Try to beat him down. By himself, right? He's by himself. He could still beat me. He has beaten me by himself because of his stamina restoration. So, it's not an automatic win. If we lose, he's gonna authority trigger. <laughs> if we lose, he's gonna authority trigger like crazy. Bring in the Black Widow. If, if it's not too late for her to be a part of it. It is not too late for her to be a part of it. Alright, is that enough? Do we have enough? I don't know. I think I better send another unit here. Sanzaburo. What's his loyalty at? Not that I can do anything about it, but... Marry a retainer to a... Oh, yeah, we can marry a... Where are you, Sansoboro? 18 loyalty. He's very loyal. More loyal than he is to Mazayuki. Okay. Wow. Alright, let's beat this bastard down. He's going to have plenty of food because we're going to cut him down to size right now. Why is he away from his camp? What, what the hell? Look, he's only got two points that he can be attacked from. That's horse shit. Alright, so the key to this is going to have to be Confuse. Now would be a good time to get up, go get some snacks, you know what I mean? See what else is going on, guys, because this is going to take a minute. <laughs> We're literally going to have to just confuse him and beat him down. And then confuse him and then beat him down until he's done. And I only, I'm only going to get two angles of attack. Unless he's going to charge. No, okay. It would have been interesting if you charged. Alright, just gonna let this play out. You know, I really can't wait for us to get a uh, Nagashino scenario. I really like to play as the Takeda at Nagashino. I, keep, I just keep thinking about it, you know? He is advancing. Holy shit. Hang on. <laughs> he is advancing. Can we cut this guy off? That'd be great because if things go south, then I can just... If things go south, then I can just take the camp and end the fight. Okay, Confuse is... he's right here. Going towards Sanzo Boro. His Confusion is almost ready. Well, you know what? It's faster, I think, to go this way, right? Just wrap around him. Okay. 
Now Sansa Burrow's got a pretty high attack, so you actually deal some decent damage. Confuse is not ready yet, almost. We gotta close the trap. I like that uh, portrait of him a lot better. It's pretty fucking cool. I don't think that matters right now. Okay, he's trying to run back now. You confused? Not yet. Not that it matters really, but <laughs> you can see how he's just beating down all my units, even completely surrounded. We're already running out of steam immediately. <laughs> He could die, yeah, you're right. He could die. We could get him. Confuse is not ready yet. I gotta make sure I don't let him break this blockade at all. With my rapidly dwindling forces. What is going on? You guys, is there a mix up here or what? I thought I sent Tokuhime in a little while ago. No, nobody needs it. No matter. Well, I guess the guy in the front needs it. Confused. Almost ready. Yeah, there's a fucking clog up here because she is not moving. Don't understand this. She should have already moved in to engage and she's not. Right. If anyone's gonna get the kill, it's gonna be the Black Widow. Alright. 
Restored his stamina, we confuse him. Take his head, Toku. Come on. Take his head. Destroyed. Some no name gave his life. Switched helmets with uh, Hideyoshi so he could get away. She killed the wrong target, but she did kill somebody. That's six kills. Yeah, that's right, Ikari. She took the wrong head. That's what I was saying. It's uh, Sao Tsao escaping from Lubu all over again. Switching helmets with his uh, son. Alright, we'll just... Why can't we kill this guy? Oh, he's 14. That's oh, really... <laughs> he hit puberty fast. 14. Yeah, that's a deep voice. Alright, are we safe? We're never safe. Alright, Gifu Castle. Did you take this yet, man? Oh, my lord. Matsu Lady. Matsu Lady makes an appearance. Come on, let's go save Gifu. Sansaburo did well in his first outing. Awari's a tough nut to crack, man. You can deploy from all your castles and cover all your bases. Okay. I wish I could get this. Let's go blockade it. We might draw some forces that are not so strong. Let's go. So like I said earlier, guys, I'm going to have uh, the Masayuki playthrough still going to be going. And then I'm going to have some battles uploaded up to the channel pretty soon. Yes, now Masa. And then Taishi, once I get a handle on Taishi, I might start uploading that as well. It's not going to be as much as Awakening. Uh, because Awakening to me, is, this is my game right now, you know, this is, this is my jam right now. Are we close enough to fight? I think this is close enough, right? But yeah, look forward to more stuff, so if you haven't subbed to the channel, make sure you sub to the channel. So you don't miss the uploads. Not great. Just leave, might as well just leave him back, right? Are we close enough? Okay. And then uh, also Kira is he's in the chat. I think he's still in the chat. He's uploading some stuff on his channel. He's doing a Brothers Rebellion run as Nobu Katsu, and Ikari's doing an Ujizani run. So check those out as well. They're both in this vein, epic struggles. Can we beat this guy one on one? No, we can't beat him fair. Look at. It's going to have to be Confuse Abuse. Because we're not beating that guy fairly. He still has Kiyomasa trauma, yeah. I don't know what happened. I, I mean, I took my eyes off of that battlefield for one second, two seconds, and in the blink of an eye, he was 2,000 soldiers were gone. Oh no. He got mobility? Hot blooded, that's what gave him. Some of these great traits actually give you passive stat buffs. But in classic Koei fashion, in classic Koei fashion, they don't describe what they do. You just have to catch it when it happens. 
Like he got a he got a uh, he just got a mobility buff from Hot Blooded, and he might have gotten an attack buff as well. I think he got plus ten plus ten. Attack increase from Cheer, and Hot Blooded gave him mobility, but. Again, Koei doesn't do a great job at explaining all their mechanics. But I've started to notice that. Just like um, officers who actively attack disengage points. I forgot what that's called. But that's another uh, gray, brown, I don't know, whatever you want to call it, trait. But it also gives buffs. Well, you want to take the camps right there. What the hell's going on? His his mobility just crippled. Look at his mobility. It's like he got hit with with uh, interfere. Like, I know the speed was down, but it just, I don't know, it seemed really slow all of a sudden. Maybe it was just speed. Alright, everybody in position. What does he do? Cheer, right? Okay. Probably gonna have to beat him down twice. Oh man, that's a lot of damage. Yeah, concerted and muskets, the one two punch. I had a feeling when I saw him in the lineup and his musket level was at five, I was like, man, this guy has the potential to just blow up a spot. And sure enough, he did. Her attack power is so bad. I'm gonna try to get him to five. All right, and then pull off. One more time, that'll do it. Not even worth it. You think I'd get a capture or something, but Gifu still stands. No thanks to uh, Ieyasu. Actually, I think if Ieyasu takes this castle, it's mine, right? I think this castle is going to belong to us if we take it. Oh, that's Keiji on the way. He's not going to make it, but... We could give it to him, though. I think I'd just give it to him. Back to base. Where are the Toyotomi forces? 84,000? 
Where is everybody? Kind of quiet. Joseph Okabe still haven't submitted. I wish I could have renewed an alliance with them, but... Oh, they're cooperative now. What's our trust at? 30? Let's renew the alliance just to prevent them from becoming a vassal. Let's do it. We'll get working on that. Hopefully I'm not too late. All right, what do we do? Uh, we need to take that. She's going to blockade this. I think it might be more important to take this. Canbay's over here. What's his loyalty? 14. Ah, uh, it's a bit low. We're not low enough, though. All right. No, let's just let's take our land at least a little bit. So we did get the castle. Did we capture anybody? No. Alright. Could we give it to, like, the Hojo, for example? No. Everyone else here has surrendered to the Toyotomi. Oh, we can't give them the castle. Okay. All right. Well, if we can't give it to them. Strongest we've been so far. I know it doesn't look great, but... Confuse abuse. How many days do we have? Three months, and also three months. Defend. All the way up there. Thirty K. It didn't even look like he had thirty K available. Alright, we took our spot back. Let's get out of here. Is this guy really gonna take you city the chemistry? Oh, he can't participate. Okay. We can still beat him, but... We're gonna get beat up. Force conscription and Gifu. Increase the soldiers by 1,000. Yeah, I'll do that. This guy has the marksman trait, so if I can capture him, I might actually be able to field the musket unit. I 
I wanted to give it to uh, Ieyasu. It's too bad that you can't give it to a clan that's farther away, like that we can't offer like shelter to the Chosokabe, for example. They're gonna be wiped out. You know how like the Mori took in the Shogun, the Ashikaga clan, gave them territory. You should be able to do that for another group. Alright, what does this guy do? Coercion, okay. Let's just move up. Hopefully Toku doesn't kill him. Big nothing. A big nothing battle. Thirty thousand units. There's fourteen K between these two. Uji Sato and um Yukinaga. I'm gonna keep her here and start fighting. Just start uh, destroying these units as they show up. Let me get my confused guy out here. He's the one that I actually need on the front here. Drawing these guys in as they come across. Okay. Oh, we have a space here for somebody. Do we not have any more? No, we only have one. I think I've been using him to build things, so I'm just going to keep him there. No soldiers for Yoshitaka. This guy's awful. Nobody to get that. Shit. One by one they'll cross and one by one we'll destroy them. This is how we're going to destroy these forces. At least for a little while. Once they get once these two arrive here, then I'm in trouble. But I can at least take out um Yoshitaka. After that I don't know what I'm gonna do. And 
deploy. Do I even need Sun to borrow for this fight? I don't think so, right? Yoshitaka, what does his tactic do? Unit defense increased, okay. We should be able to beat him. charge that up so basically just push him back to his camp I mean there's no point there's no reason not to whoa what are you doing oh no she's out for blood Run, run, run. <laughs> she triggered that speedy at just at the right time. She got the hell out of there. Alright. Let this confused charge up and then deal with this guy. Why can't I? There you go. Okay. It's ugly, but this is the only way to win. This is the only avenue open to me. One of these days, I'd like to try to do a run with with uh, no confuse, a no confuse run, just to see how badly, how much of a drop off it would be. Oh, okay. I had a feeling he was going to do that. Well, Nobukatsu, you stay there. Let's get Confused Guy out of the way, because he's the reason. He's how we're going to win. Is he in the camp? Out of the camp? What's going on here? He is technically out of the camp. This is awkward. Okay, that fixed them. <sighs> All right, now we just gotta wait. Confuse abuse our way.
Yeah, he is he is pretty strong. I'm trying to hold Daniel, but I don't know how much longer I'm going to hold, honestly. If everybody just keeps submitting to the Toyotomi across the map, it's going to get to that point where you're just fighting the whole map, you know? Or you're fighting the Toyotomi and everyone else is sitting out in the war. I gotta pull this guy back. My damage is just abysmal. I guess if things get really bad, I can always give away Gifu again. But I'd rather not have to do that. One of the gambles I'm taking too is that I'm using the Tokugawa to attack for me. And I'm relying on, on my own forces to defend. So instead of using the Tokugawa to come and bail me out, I'm using the Tokugawa to take over Minnow. So the Tokugawa is taking over Minnow for me while I'm trying to fend off and survive. So what I'm hoping will happen is if I keep doing this, if I keep it up, what I'm hoping will happen is I'll get most or all of Minnow and then I can switch and have the Tokugawa help me defend. And then, and then start to get stronger. But it's very risky because if my defense, if my forces aren't enough to defend, then that's going to be it. I don't think I'm going to be able to capture this guy. I don't have the damage. Yeah, there he goes. I had, I had to deal a lot more damage to be able to get him... Uh, in a confused, in a confused uh, state. Well, we're getting all the honor. That's something. Okay, so another unit destroyed crossing the ford. This next wave is not going to be so easy because it's not just one unit. It's three. Plus we have this force coming over the top towards Gifu Castle. So I'm going to have to defend one castle and then run and defend the other one. Mitsunari's on the way. Yoshitsugu. Oh my god. Not anybody but Yoshitsugu. Okay. Alright guys. I think I'm going to call it there. It is getting long in the night. Oh. So I'll be back uh, Saturday with the next upload for this run. We're going to have Mazuyuki coming up. Nobunaga's Ambition Taishi. Whenever I... Uh, once I get that down a little bit, I'll start uploading some videos from that too. It's not going to be as frequent as Awakening though. But And also I'm not... You know, I, I have to see if I like it too. But assuming that I figure out Taishi and that there's some room there to to have fun. To have like, you know scenarios like this then I'll, I might start I'll start uploading some Tai Chi as well I'm just not sure if the combat system if the way the game is designed like if if it allows for smaller clans to really survive you know not every Koei game allows you to play like this a lot of them it's just like hey if you don't pick the top 10 if you don't pick the faces of the franchise then you know what I mean you're gonna get run over and that's it you know, sometimes they design their games that way. So, if it if there's room there for me to to mess around with, then I'll then I'll start uploading some Tai Chi. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, take care, guys.